I'm and I'm back with another Front Row Talk podcast, a podcast with expensive opinions. Before I start, make sure you subscribe, you like, you comment, and you share this video. Check the description down below. I have my link for my Instagram, TikTok, uh, and Twitter. Uh, Episode 116, uh, where I'll be talking about basically the same thing I talked about uh, in the last um, episode. I don't think, I think since since those two episodes... Two games have passed. Today I'm recording Wednesday the 12th. Um, be another game. Game three in a couple of hours. Um, and I just kind of want to, you know, keep talking about the finals. What, what, what has happened. <clears throat> by the time you guys are seeing this, it, it'll be Friday. I think by then it'll probably be game four. So a lot could happen till then. But let's get started. Um, so yeah, for everybody who knows already, it's Celtics and... Um, Mavs in the finals. Um, I had Celtics in six so far. That's looking pretty good. Um, but it's a lot to address. I mean, Brown is playing phenomenal. He's playing like the best player on the Celtics. Um, that's something that's been, you know, a conversation that's been popping up a bit more and more uh, recently. A lot of people still won't agree that he's the best player in the Celtics. Uh, I may be a little biased because he's one of my favorite players. But um, he's playing like the best player. Uh, Tatum is contributing, though. So he's doing his thing, but he's not being 1A. You know, he's not scoring 30-plus or whatever. And sometimes you may not have to do that, to, you know, to be the best player. But it's just certain expectations out of certain players that you expect. And, you know, he's really not going there. And he hasn't even scored a 30-point game in the finals yet. Tonight might be the night um, in Dallas House. Who knows? But um, <clears throat> it's just something that's expected from a lot of people. I mean, from the fans, from everybody. When you're just, you know, Jason Tatum, I guess you could say. Um, not calling him the best player in the league, but he's definitely one of the best. Um, Kyrie hasn't showed up. Uh, like I said, it could all change today, game three. But those two games in Boston, he had, he was doing. He was nowhere to be found. A lot of people started bashing him. <clears throat> um, and he was walking out the um, the the court, going like to the locker room or whatever, at the ending of game two, and he was just showing up five, um, you know, five, basically saying they'll be back for game five. They're not gonna swap, and I think that they would be back in 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 Boston for game five. I don't think Celtics are sweeping them. I do still think they're winning the series in six games. Um, but Kyrie has to show up tonight. He has to do his thing. Um, I mean, they're home, so at least they got the home crowd behind them. Uh, if that's what, you know, really gets at Kyrie, but can't really say that that's what it is. Even though he's had a horrible losing record um, against the Celtics, uh, it was a stat or a post talking about um, last time <clears throat> that Kyrie beat the Celtics. And um, Kyrie was still with the big three in Boston. I mean, in, 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 in Brooklyn, my fault. Um, Giannis didn't have a ring. Porzingis was with the Mavs. Uh, and it was a couple other things. So it's been a long time. Um, it's been a long time since he's beat Boston. Um, hopefully tonight is the night. It has to be. Because if Boston goes up 3-0, that may be it. You know, Even though if Mavs win the second game, I'll have them Celtics in five then. Um, but yeah, it's, it's looking tough. Uh, a lot of role players is doing good on the Boston Celtics. And Porzingis, shout out to him. Even though he may not be back tonight for game three. Um, but, yeah. A lot of people's doing good. Drew Holiday had a 26-point game. Almost a 30-point game in the finals. That's huge. Um, Derek White has been doing good, too. Uh, but now, all the pressure is on, on the Mavs. They're home. They're down 2-0. Um, they, have, they have to win both at home. Because if they go down 3-1, no team has ever come back from 3-1. Uh, no team so I mean of course a team with Luka you gotta have some type of faith but it's like realistically speaking you know and of course you know I I wasn't going with that last series when Mavs was up 3-1 the only reason I entertained it was because you know um, the Wolves were down I mean I had Wolves in 7 already so I just kind of kept going with it Um, but yeah so if they're going down 3-1 it ain't looking good and I know a lot of people's Luka fans, and Luka's a great player. I mean, he's doing his thing this series, as expected. Can't really get at him, um, even though 
there's been a bunch of clips on Twitter showing him like how many blow buys uh, he's been letting hap- like happen, you know, players getting by him. Uh, but it's like, how much can he do? Uh, it's, it's, you could be on, on, a, you could be defending him, you could be getting at him. I mean, I don't know. Um, it's, it's just, he's still a good player. We can't deny that. Um, but Tatum, he needs this, the 30 point game, at least one, at least one. Cause then if they do win the finals, you know, finals MVP is up in the air. He just can't be given to Tatum just cause he's Tatum. Brown will be up there for sure. Um, and yeah. Let's see, let's see how the, the Mavs respond. Um, the series ain't over. That's why the episode ain't too long. There's so much that could happen. We still could have seven games. Who knows? But um, I just wanted to come up here and kind of recap a little bit um, of what's been going on in the series. Uh, I'm super duper excited to see the game later. Um, and yeah, let's see if, if, if my take is still right. Celtics and six. Let's see if they won before. Let's see if they won after. Let's see if they lose. You know, um, we just gonna have to see. So far, I I think I seen a stat too saying that game one of the finals is probably like the least watched finals game in a long time, and I'm surprised because last year it was a way different matchup. You know, in the East and West in the finals, I feel like this matchup is way better, and people not really tuning in this year. That's that's pretty weird, but yeah, it's 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 a lot going on. Um, you know, and just basically Tatum or, or Luka could win their first ring. Still up in the air. Uh, but, yeah, let's see how it goes. Uh, that's really it for this episode. Make sure you subscribe, you like, you comment, and you share this video. Um, by the time you guys see it, this is game four. Either the Celtics is up 3-0 or, or, or um, Dallas is down 2-1. But just a game closer to time in the series. Make sure you subscribe, you like, you comment, you share, check the description. The boy Salsita is out.